What is up guys, it's JDAC Gaming here. Today I'm going to be explaining the Season 2 update stats and what character I think is the best. Which I recommend the Shantarian is the best out of the two characters. Very fun to play, very easy to get the hang of, but let's get in. Let's see what we get! Okay! I'm hoping to get some more yeah. uh, complete sets of the rare weapons and some rare armor because that would be nice because all I'm seeing is old armor right here nothing really new come on come on come on oh new helmet gun plant that looks nice I like I equip looks good I'll see how that looks out after. So we've got a nice axe head to put on. Horse. We're looking for those stars, man. Let's unbox some more, guys. Let's see what we get. Come on. Ah. I'm not seeing anything new, guys. Not really anything new. Come on, come on, come on. No. Just spit on me game. Hey, cool. Come on, come on, come on. Why did I see anything shiny? I want that new axe head, man. Come on. Then a lot of time. I do like that stuff that spews Come on, come on, come on. Mid. Never heard of that. New stuff, okay. Sounds interesting. What is that? Hey? Five hundred. This was our last box, guys. Come on, lucky, luck, 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 luck. What's the? Hey, Shinsinku. Okay, I've got a pummel. Looks like a kraken. Ooh, it's nice. All right, guys, let's get to explaining this. So, what you can do here. This is for the radar, I don't know about any other characters, but I do recommend you get rid of um, debuff resistance. It's completely, utterly useless. Defense and recus exhaust recovery is very useful, so yeah, I would recommend keeping that on your helmet. Chest, I like to keep it balanced. So keep it balanced there because you need revenge mode and revenge mode um, duration. You could cut out defense and focus on both of the lower stats, but I like to keep it balanced because the raider needs to defense a lot, need to block a lot, so that helps with a lot of other stuff. Again, I keep the ship balanced, but if you wanted to, you could go full. You can swap out either one of these. It depends on your playstyle, guys. Because I play the Raider, so typically I don't go fully out ham. Because he's not a fast character, he's more of a character that has to block period and then go in. And this is my axe head. As you can see, it's a primary axe head. But there is something you can swap on. I don't think I have an axe head with it. But. Basically. You can swap on block. Damage. Because basically what block damage is. The damage. The percent of damage that you do while people are blocking. So it's like damage reduction or something, I don't even know completely myself, but I know what defense penetration is, is armor pen pretty much. That's my head, 
This is my style that I'm using right, right now. Get back to it. As you can see, I've skipped out on revive speed because that's typically what I don't need. But you can go balance here if you want to be a hybrid character with like that. I reckon that's the best stats you can get on an axe. As you can see, my axe is maxed up fully. And it's not the right stats. So this is not the right stats to be perfect for an axe. For the staff. So this is. Because it's... Like, of course it's lower, but as you can see, it gives you more attack because the execution health is lower, which is better. I thought I should put that into there. Then Pummel, keep that balanced because I do recommend keeping gear in as much revenge as possible. Hopefully this guy's just helped you out a lot. Like, I'd rather keep it balanced with armor and stuff, but we can take out stuff safely wherever you please. And I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video.